So the four-year wait is finally over. Day one of the grandest event in world football. And a grand welcome to you as you join us for our live coverage of what we hope will be a game that sets it off in style. Just have a look at it, feel it. This really is the best of the beautiful game in motion at fever pitch. And the players are ready. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. A moment of great pride, the anthems. Well, that was impressive. Match that. The imperative for everyone, three points on opening day. Yeah, and it's obvious, Peter, you don't want to be playing catch-up after the opening group game. So we can expect this to be highly competitive. Three points here and the feel-good factor of eventual progression kicks in. It's a, a great foundation to tackle the rest of the, uh, the group games. running just wouldn't be beaten there and that is as far as they're going to go and here's more Mores! superb goal what a start and what a contribution from the main man i had a feeling he might do something given his reputation but to do it like that absolutely brilliant i wasn't expecting that Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Algeria have an early lead. Good start. And he's searching through. Just the keep. Unas! Really well taken goal. 2-0, and they're already threatening to run riot. Jim, your thoughts? Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Algeria took a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby. Lovely feet. 
And the ball's come out. And the counter is on. Forward it goes. Bayouzi Gulam just did a brilliant job there. It was one of those but shapes to shoot! They are rampant! And they're at it again in double quick time! Algeria are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. Algeria take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking to, to cause even more damage here. And it's Mares. He's through the middle. This is going for goal! He scores! And already they're looking to run away with it. Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. He snaffles his third, and that earns him the match ball. Oh, this has been an immense contribution for one player. He's been just about unplayable. The irresistible force today. become a case of men against boys no doubt as to who has the momentum here now the only doubt is how many is coming doesn't get the pass he's looking for Mares Una a chance has a hit oh real in for the follow up got right underneath it. OK, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. Kessier. Bentaleb gets it back. To be more accurate, tries to get it forward quickly. Mares. hoists it forward. He's left his man. Interception. Mares. The intervention was very necessary. They've been given a corner. been taken short and out to safety out for a throw Taha 
And it's Morris. Morris. Now it's Morris. Oh, Red, he sorted that out. And it's played forward. It's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Brahimi. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Back into the middle. And here's Brahimi. Goes for goal. Tries to get it clear. Bailly can get it clear. Mores. Oh, the question, that's a foul. Keeper sends it forward. Brahimi. Back to the keeper. And they've been caught out here. Fence has got rid of that. did look promising to start with, but in the end they were thwarted before they could even make it into the final third. Hoists it forward. Just needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Walk forward. What does he try from here? Una. Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. And the shot! Back of the net! Well, surely that completes the demolition if it hadn't occurred already. Well, I wasn't expecting him to go this big, Peter, but they have been superb. Things looking so easy, almost too easy here. Good challenge, he just stood firm. The referee's awarded a free kick. Positioned. I was expecting him to play it in until I saw his run up. Gets it upfield. What an adventurous run from a defender. And it's corner. Mares plays it short. Oh, what a ball! Chooses to go back. Brahimi. Real chance! He scored! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight! Listen, when you're on an invitation to improve your goal difference, why he's off? Four in the game. He is the man.
Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition looked completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Confirmation that there will be two minutes stoppage time. Chance to break. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. That's not going to make it. And it's the whistle for half time. Well, that flew by. It was breathless stuff. It's been one way traffic here after the first 45 minutes. A relentless barrage that looks set to continue. Algeria have been more or less perfect, I would say. Their manager's all smiles, and he's got every reason to be. Algeria pretty much out of sight here. It really has been a one-sided game so far. Already up and running for the second half. Bye. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. And it's Brahimi. Bailly gets into the right position to intercept. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. They could break here. He's got through. Surely. Goes for goal. I wouldn't fancy playing up front in these circumstances, to be honest. There's absolutely no supply. Mares. Brahimi. Aurier. Aurier sends it forward. Sahar. Ulam plays it forward. Una. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Keeper's got good distance on that. And he's away. He's picked him out. Given offside once more. <laughs> Forward it goes. Ivory Coast keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Bailly tries to get it forward quickly. Finds himself eased off the ball. And it's Brahimi. He's played him through. Good take, and he's had a... He's gone for it! He's put it wide. Algeria know they can rely on the counter, and they've just expressed a warning. Oh, Rip has a goal! He the best in the keeper. That was good defensive pressure to give him less manoeuvring room. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Big chance! 
rushing forward at pace. be one straight back and once more they can't get through Bailly cuts it out Bailly plays it forward Goulart Unas is effectively being marked out of the game here. Well, he helps himself to a treble, Peter, and then they switch on. It's a bit late now. Down by a lack of accuracy. Just brushed off the ball there. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. And now they can launch a counter. He's in! It's Brahimi! It's in! Well, just another one to add to what has already been an incredible haul. By the looks of it, there may be still more to come. for a change in personnel. <laughs> Can't get the better of his opposite number. Good ball. Una has a hit! Away from immediate danger. Hoists it forward. Let's put a stop to that. And it's played forward. Looking to force his way through. That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. Good idea, just poorly executed. And here's Brahimi. Bentaleb. Plays it out to the flank. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Defenders on the back foot. Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right. He couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock solid. without complication and back to base keeper sends it forward pings it out wide Una has a pop and that's past the post Ivory Coast making consecutive changes here. Bentaleb. A mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. Tries to get it forward quickly. 
Speared forward. And here's Mores. Sahar. And here's Brahimi. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. For Fana, Kessier, forward it goes, and here's the chance to counter. And that is that. Pretty much the ideal start. A win on the first day, and a platform on which to build. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Listen, ideally, any new campaign needs a start that puts three points on the board, and it's mission accomplished. Nothing to